Hi everyone! We're back with another how to design using Designboard video. So you know, Christmas is coming up just in several days, and literally everyone around me is already excited and fully prepared for it. My workplace has set up a Christmas tree. We're also about to organize a party for Christmas. That is the reason why I will show you how to create an office Christmas party invitation card, which I will definitely send to all my colleges. As usual, I'm gonna be using Desibo to design a card. Now, to find some layouts, I click on Collection. There it is. What you see on screen now is Desibo's collection of layouts and templates for all graphic types. These are the newest ones. We've got a bunch of New Year 2017 templates here because New Year is also about to come after Christmas, right? The templates are updated every day. So what we want to do now is to create an invitation card, right? Um, on the left hand right here is a list of graphic types. I will choose events and invitation cards. Let's see the portrait ones. These are pretty cool, but I don't really like the size very much though. I will switch to the invitation right here. Okay, these are perfect. I think I'm gonna choose this one. It looks kinda simple, but I like it that way. Obviously, it needs some adjustments, but that would not be a problem since we are freely to customize the templates on Desibo. So this is the workspace, and the design is ready to work on. First, I will need to change some text, the name of the party. This will be office party, and this is Christmas night. We plan to hold the party on the 23th of December, so definitely change the date here and drag to make it in the center. We are not gonna have any DJ though, so I would just write Happy New Year and change the size to make the text look bigger and the address as well. 19th floor at CMCC Tower, Hilton Street. Okay, done. To be honest, this doesn't look so Christmas to me. I think I would change the color. This blue thing should be green. I mean, all the blue things in here. And we should not forget those little cute pine trees down here. Okay, much better now. Let's delete these bells because I don't like them. And that red snowflake too. I will find something to replace them. Search for the vectors here. Choose holidays. Let's see. There are a lot. How about this cute red shock? Yes, I'll take it. Put it where the snowflake used to be. Rotate it a little bit. This card should be decorated with more stuff. Let's take this cute icon of a green ornament. Put it here and scale it down. I think the color is too bold, so I will adjust the transparency of it. Okay, now do the same thing with another one in red. And put it next to the green one. I think that's enough for the decoration. You know, we should not put too many things in here or else it will look really messy. This will do to me. I'm satisfied with the result. I will compare my work with the original one on Zabo's collection. You see? To be honest, I think mine looks so much better and more Christmas. 
So, this is me having no professional graphic design skill, but still be able to create such a beautiful Christmas invitation card, thanks to Desibold. You know, you can also do the same thing. Just visit Desibold and you will not be disappointed. It is a so easy tool to use and you will have a bunch of ideas for graphic design. The most important thing is, it's totally free. I mean, Desibold does have a membership plan which will charge you some money. There would be many more cooler things for the membership accounts. But it's up to you. You can definitely use it for free if you want to. So that is the end of the video. Hope you can create some amazing graphic designs with Desibold after watching this. See you next time on another how-to design video. Bye!